On to something which is newer, which is uh, Dinner in America, which we haven't spoken about before, which is an oddball, indie-spirited comedy about a punk rock singer who finds himself holed up in the house of his biggest fan. It's written, directed by uh, Adam Raymeyer, who, weirdly enough, earned some notoriety some years ago by directing a film called The Bunny Game, which was banned outright by the BBFC in the UK. Uh, Yeah, I mean, literally, I can't remember the last time that happened. It's, uh, they said, in the, in the carefully considered view of the BBFC, to issue a certificate to the bunny game, even if confined to adults, would be inconsistent with the guidelines, would risk potential harm within the terms of the Video Recordings Act, and would be accordingly unacceptable to the public. This is a very different kettle of fish. This is, this is a, I said, a quirky comedy. It's been tonally compared to Repo Man and Napoleon Dynamite. And the title refers to the torturous spectre of the family dinner in America and everything that goes with it. Here's a clip. So, how was school today? Oh my God, is it always gonna be an inquisition? What did you do today, hmm? You better tame that tone, mister. I'm done, may I be excused, please? No, you may not. You're gonna sit there with all of us, eat your taco salad and have dessert. I got a chocolate cake. Oh. Hey, mom, can I go see a rock show with Sissy and Karen on Friday? Sissy and Karen? That's a blast from the past. I haven't heard you talk about them since you dropped out of junior college. What's the group? Oh, but they're this really cool group from New York City. They're um, really smart and stuff. The music is almost educational. What's the name of the group? The Alliance. Oh, I don't know. That that sounds pretty militant, the Alliance. I don't like the sound of this New York militia music. Oh, come on, I never get to do anything fun! Hey, you need to take it down a notch. Shut the hell up, Kev! Whoa, 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 watch the language. It's a great central performance by Emily Skeggs. Of course, she doesn't want to go and see the Alliance. She wants to see the support group, whose singer then turns up. But because when he plays with the group, his group, he wears a mask and no one knows what he looks like. So she doesn't realise that he is the, the, the leader of the band with whom she has been obsessed and he is looking for a place to stay. As I said, they've cited uh, things like Napoleon Dynamite. I think for me, it was more like a cross between Bonnie and Clyde and Breaking the Waves as reimagined as a twisted American television sitcom. I mean, it, it's not for everyone, but it works because the chemistry between the leads is so odd, so peculiar, that it. I, I was charmed by it. There's also, there is a great scene in which they write a song, which I have sub- subsequently tried to, fi- to find on Spotify. I haven't found it yet, but when I do, I will have it on hard rotation. Supporting players include Leah Thompson, who of course once played the human lead in Howard the Duck. And I was thinking, what a great double bill this would make. Dinner in America and say, Howard sorry, the did, Duck. Did you say you played the Human League? The in Human Howard Lead. <laughs> yeah, that's right. They played the Human League, but also played the Human Lead as opposed to played <laughs> played played the the Duck Lead. But it's a very odd, very quirky, very strange film from a director with a very very dubious back catalogue, and I enjoyed it. And it's called Dinner in America, and it's available on VOD.